My name is Ben Levitz. I'm the principal of Studio on Fire in Minneapolis. We are underground in our subterranean print shop here in the edge of northeast Minneapolis. And what we do is a variety of pressure-based printing. We do letterpress, we do foil stamping, we do engraving. Um, all of these things are pressure-based specialty printing. Our specialty as a print shop is working alongside designers to do very highly crafted print elements. So whereas a lot of the, the printing that you see uh, nowadays is digitally produced um, and very flat in nature, what we bring to the table is a specialty product that is very often tactile in that you can feel the impression in it, you can feel uh, the difference in materials that are used for it, and uh, it's in the end a design object, not just something that is uh, going to be tossed aside quickly. Our clients are other designers and craftspeople that have a love for things that are well crafted. And we're a great fit in what we do to bring and reflect that craft back in how something is actually produced. We have to inform what that artwork needs to change to in order to do a good job on it. And that's, that's a time consuming part, is overcoming the uh, learning curve that you encounter with oftentimes clients that have never done this kind of printing before and uh, are, are expecting to just send off a Photoshop JPEG and have it magically happen. My favorite part of what we do, hands down, is that every day something is actually being made and you get something that comes off of, of press and is going in a box out to a client that's well crafted and seeing something actually be made and see the light of day and know that it's landing in somebody else's hands as a, a finished piece of work is a great feeling. I, I love the, th there's a little bit of a gearhead side to what a, a shop like ours involves. Is you're doing a lot of repair on your own uh, presses. You have to be well informed about how to fix uh, vintage equipment when it goes wrong. Sometimes that means finding used parts somewhere in the country. Sometimes that means recrafting a part. Um, but it always means, you know, working with a press that is uh, certainly a lot older than I am and will live a lot longer than I will. And these machines just need the love and, and care of uh, experienced people. Last year we were uh, part of the Posters and Pints show and we did an interesting letterpress take on the 99 bottles of beer and had uh, literally a little sketched out 99 different bottles of, of beer uh, on, a, on a poster that was just a one color letterpress. And we're excited to be back again this year for uh, a, a, a surprising result. No spoilers? No spoilers. So we're excited to be one of 40 artists at the Posters and Pints show in Northeast Minneapolis at Uppercut on May 30th. We'll see you there.